Good morning. It's Wednesday, March 1st. It's new month, folks. And Top Story will keep you marching right along with the latest news. Give us a like and subscribe below, then check out the full World Watch show. Now, this is Top Story. Today, the corporate kingdom finally comes to an end. There's a new sheriff in town, and accountability will be the order of the day. On Monday, Florida's Governor Ron DeSantis signed a law taking away the Disney Corporation's self-governing right to rule its own district. DeSantis says Disney has been getting special treatment and unfair tax breaks. But critics say he's punishing Disney for criticizing what some call his don't say gay law. That law prohibits pushing inappropriate sexual instruction onto school kids. And actually, DeSantis is battling those who force an out of step agenda onto society. Florida is where woke goes to die. Last year, DeSantis wanted to revoke Disney's Reedy Creek Improvement District. But that would have saddled the state with more than a billion dollars in debt. Florida would have inherited the cost of maintaining the district's roads, schools, utilities, police, emergency services, and so on. Instead, the bill he signed would give DeSantis, not the Disney Kingdom, the power to appoint the board members who govern the district. Headlines can be scary. Talking about them with kids doesn't have to be. Introducing Concurrently, the News Coach podcast from God's World News. Let's teach children with calm discernment. Remember, you can watch the full World Watch show for free for a week. Just head to our site at worldwatch.news forward slash free video. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I'm the Big Bash. Remember, whatever the news, the purpose of the Lord will stand.